What's up guys and welcome back to another video now just to go over this man of the month Le'Veon Bell lots of people disappointed Andy Dalton um, There's a few nice Slot receivers and he all maybe a few really fast running backs that walk good um, So you might want to look at that although the sets are not exactly cheap and Le'Veon Bell is going for way less than the 93 Julio Jones so like if you're looking to sell the person you get from it, you want to do Julio Jones or just save your collectible for next month. Although they seem to be raising the amount of, not collectibles this month, but the amount of playoffs every month. That needs to go into the set. I think last month was only, the first month was 30, I think. I think the next month was 35 too. So I don't think they've changed anything from this month to last month, but hey. Um, football Outsiders needs revamped or they at least need to make it so collectibles are popping out of packs faster uh this is a little bit of a gant video you know amari cooper that i want him he is expensive as fuck um eagles if you're an eagles fan um uh, malcolm jenkins got a strong safety card as you can see right there um he got a strong safety card and now McLeod has a full safety card and they have the same deep defender chemistry. So if you're an Eagles fan like me, you might want to look into that. But here's the thing that's pissing me off. The gauntlet. Philip Rivers. What the fuck? I didn't want him. I was hoping it was gonna be costing once, but whatever. Um these all these collectible things. I'm was like, okay, look. Once the gauntlet comes out on November the 1st, I can get all these. It expires November the 5th. I can get all these and get the one elite player. No, they're releasing the gauntlet tomorrow, Saturday, November 5th, the day these expire. So, you can't use the gauntlet to get these. Coincidence? I, th I, th I th 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 think not. What the fuck, EA? So, I'm a little salty about that. Full stop. Second off, just so we get on the legends and stuff out of the way. Andre Johnson, Kurio Tribute, probably the hottest legend tomorrow. Um, he's just the Kurio Tribute Legend Special Edition. I'm not sure if there's gonna even be a set for him. He might just be a limited time card. Straight up. Second off, Ness knew at least he has a card in the game that people can be turned into an ultimate legend and then maybe a golden ticket if somebody wants to. You know there's crazy Texans fans out there that are going to do that. Anyways. Um. And then two other own faults. There was a strong safety coming out with hot hands and pick specialist. Not too bad. I'm sure Victionary is hyped about Philip Rivers. The Gauntlet 90 Overgrown that will be released tomorrow. I know people are pissed about that because they were saving their collectibles. And... Now he's probably not even going to be worth that much. So if you're looking for an actual good QB and you only want to spend about 13k, he'll probably be 13k within the next week. Um, uh, there was a left tackle that came up. Why don't they release right tackles? They released two left tackle legends. We need a fucking right tackle already. I know I don't even get it that good a team. I don't get the legends. But for those people that do, let's go to Guy Tackle. Let's just go to Guy Tackle and see what's up. Load. VA Solvers crash and now I'm asleep. Um. Over oh, gone. Yeah. 86. That's good quality. Just, just. Just to make sure. Okay, 86. Now let, let's let's make sure there's no 90s. Come on, load, load. EA solvers are absolute garbage right now. Um. Oh look, there's a Marcus Gilmore. I actually have this guy. Not the auctionable version though. That is the best guy right tackle. That is the best guy right tackle in the game. What the fuck? Like, people don't like Legend Offensive Line, man. But if you had released a right tackle, and not a left tackle, which there's already one of, we might have been happier. Like, EA, just think. 
what positions don't have legends, not what legends do we want to see. Also, I am pissed about Andre Johnson coming out for one reason. Guess who's going to be killing? Out in head-to-head. -head. Everybody's going to want him. And he's going to be an absolute... He's going to be fucking Randy Moss 2.0. He's going to be fucking ruining me out there with my shit cornerbacks. Anyways, guys, if you like this video... Hit the thumbs up button. Subscribe down below. Or go. I don't. Don't know. Buy this new 3 for 1 pro pack. But you have to use your money. And then you're like. Oh shit. I already have my. <laughs> already have my. Already have my cash. Hooked up to my account. Might as well just. Purchase. um. Oh. Might as well just purchase the bundle. I'm kidding. Nobody does this. But. 50 bucks. Oh, let might as well get two of them. A hundred bucks right out the fucking window. Oh, and then yeah, I know they give you the bonus so you can then get 14 pro packs. Whoa, which then you can pull nothing out of. Literally, somebody opened the bundle. I think they only opened one, so it was 50 bucks, and they pulled 185 elite. I know there's just one person, but just pack odds still aren't good. Um, if you guys want to see a gauntlet form video, I know I just gamble in this video right now, but get the fuck over it and leave if you want to. If you guys do want to see a gauntlet pack opening, all the gauntlet packs on a legend day, if I can get them all done tomorrow, I will, or maybe Sunday the video will come out. But if you want to see that, hit the thumbs up button and tell me down in the comments what other content you want to see. And goodbye. From Los Angeles. I'm kidding. You don't know where I live, bitches.